Hmm. Let's see what's going on on YouTube today. Do, 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 do. YouTube. What do we have on YouTube today? Oh, we got Scotty Kramer YouTube channel. We're doing some trick shot challenge. Oh, Rather Be Welding is doing some more work on his 125. Jet Ski Brothers just cut up another ski. Rumi Official. This is ho how old I am, really. <laughs> Project Firm. Will graphite help motor oil performance? Let's find out. That's a good question. Demolition Ranch. Does a bulletproof hoodie actually work? Not something I need to know, but I love watching his videos. What is going on over on Joel Ersnow's channel? 2,000 subscribers? What? Hey guys, I was just looking at my YouTube channel and noticed that uh, I've got 2,000 subscribers. That's kind of mind-blowing. So uh, I thought I'd take a minute to kind of talk about what's going on with my channel and uh, thank everybody for subscribing and watching the videos. And I've never done a video like this before. And most of my videos are kind of all over the place. If you've actually watched my channel, uh, even just in the last little while, you will see that I have BMXing videos, some videos of working on engines, jet skiing videos, milling, lathe videos, uh, mountain bike videos, all kinds of different stuff. So, I don't really fit into any category. I do some vlogging stuff and then I do some kind of almost how-to stuff. And uh, yeah, so where is the channel going and what is happening? Stay tuned. It is April 13th. I almost said 2014. Why would I say that? It is April 13th, 2020. We are in the middle of a pandemic and I run a small business that operates seasonally between April and October. So I'm gearing up to uh, do my job and not really sure if I'm actually going to get any work this summer. So it's kind of a little bit nerve wracking, but I think once the weather warms up, uh, things will turn around. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I am a small engine mechanic. I run my own business and I go out to people's homes and repair their lawnmowers. I haven't done much video footage of that. so. Probably not many of you actually know that I do that. In the off season, I make some YouTube videos. I ride my BMX bike and this past September, uh, I bought a jet ski, rode it once and then tore it apart. I've been making some videos about that. Uh, I also do some milling and work on my lathe. I do all sorts of projects uh, in my garage and uh, yeah, my channel isn't really focused on one thing, but I thought I would let you guys know what is going on right now and what I think might happen over the summer. The bike park that I normally ride at, which is Beeline Indoor Bike Park, it opened in 2017. I turned 40 and I started riding there quite frequently. Uh, it is closed down because of the pandemic. I'm not sure if it will open up. Also, all of the other bike parks in the area are closed down so I am going to probably like everyone else be resorting to biking around my neighborhood and building things to ride on uh, so that should be interesting I have considered breaking the unicycle back out and doing some videos with that it's always interesting and fun and uh, very challenging so um, you could see that in the future uh, right now as I said focusing on work stuff, trying to get my business going. Um, I'm doing a lot of work with my jet ski. I just finished doing some fiberglass work, which you may have seen some videos of. Uh, the previous owners had done some shady fiberglass repairs, and so I'm trying to make things right before I go out on the water and sink it. Um, 
I am currently trying to build a machine to balance my flywheel on the jet ski so that uh, I can remove material from it. This is a spare flywheel that I have. It became spare when I destroyed it. Uh, so I'm trying to build a machine to balance my flywheel. And what else? I am quite far behind on editing videos, so it is currently April 13th, as I have stated at least twice now. Uh, but I am just releasing videos from October 2019. So, as I catch up and get rid of my old footage, you will be seeing more bike videos possibly build videos of whatever contraptions I build the bike on, probably some unicycle videos, uh, definitely some jet ski videos or working on jet ski videos. Hopefully I get it running and get it out. The plans for the jet ski as of now are to finish up with the fiberglass work, uh, bore out the cylinders and put some new pistons in it, get the engine back together and put back in and hopefully get this out and ride it a few times this summer and then in the fall of 2020 uh, rip it down and do a nice paint job on it i've already picked out a color scheme and you may know if you've been watching the videos what that is so i had decided on making this kind of a classic 1990s kawasaki motocross looking style with like the fluorescent green, pink, yellow, purple colors. I was gonna do something like that and I was about to order powder coating supplies and then for some reason I came up with the idea that I currently have. I haven't seen any other jet skis at all with this color scheme. I think it's very unique and I love the colors together. I've never had an opportunity to paint anything that color and so now I'm actually thinking if the Mini ever gets finished, which is my 1976 Mini, uh, yeah, I might actually do it in that color because I really, really like the color scheme. That's about it on uh, what's happening on my channel. I've now got 2,000 subscribers. Thank you to everyone who's been subscribing and watching my videos. If there's something that you would like to see more of on my channel, leave it below in the comments and I will at least consider it. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.